Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Thursday edition of Comics on TV. I'm Mike. And I'm Kevin, your buddy Jump Street. <laughs> this week we're going to be talking about Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., Flash, and Arrow. First and foremost, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Right. Strong, strong episode. I thought so. Yeah, Agent, uh, Coulson has a plan. He's sticking to it. Yeah. You know, he's got his boys, he's got Trip. he's got Sky. <laughs> he's got even Fitz doing a six-minute yeah. plan. Yeah, no, it's pretty cool. Yeah. I like the time crunch. Yeah, it was very, very, very time crunch. I mean, he uh, is pretty much trying to get these satellites ready so he can find this map or whatever he thinks it is. He thinks it's, it's a city. city. Yeah, he right. thinks it's a city. Uh, Ward? Oh, one point. <laughs> oh. And devious and, and scary and, and whatnot. Yeah, I mean, you, 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 <laughs> you figured out which brother's worst of the wards. Uh, yeah, and it took you a while to get there in this episode, but spoiler alert, it's Grant. <laughs> Tim Decay from White Collar doesn't make it through this episode. But it's so mysterious and dark, I can't wait to see what happens. I really, really can't. When well, now that him. he's firmly ensconced in the, the, the hierarchy of Hydra, yeah. um, I think that's going to move it along. Yeah, well, speaking of Hydra, Alexander Pierce, we kind of figure out his whole backstory now and how Peggy Carter kind of links into it. Right. We got to see her on screen again, yep. leading into her Agent Carter coming to, you know, a screen near you on ABC. Watch it during the break. <laughs> Watch it during the break. But we found out that his uh, his relationship with, you know, has been around for a long time. Yeah. He was in jail forever. Yeah. And he kind of, you know, he even brought up the Red Skull that hasn't even been referred to since Captain America, you know, first, you know the first Avenger. Right. So the Red Skull may be making an appearance on S.H.I.E.L.D. Wouldn't that be pretty cool? It would be, but uh, much like the Thor crossover, probably won't show up. You won't see him. They'll just talk about him. Yeah. There's a lot of things going on. Bobby and her ex, you know, interrogating the guy. and Oh, dude, totally tight. That dude's dead, by the way. And on top of it, okay, their relationship back and forth, that zing, 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 perfect. I Dis laugh. I disagree. Weakest what? part of you the hated? episode. Weakest part of the you episode. You hated it? I liked her taking her shirt off, but that was pretty awesome. That was pretty Um But yeah, I mean Colson and the doctor, you yeah. know, aka Sky's dad, coming up and God, Kyle McLaughlin is just so charming. Yeah. <laughs> charmingly charmingly evil. Yeah. Good way? He's like, oh let me, I'm a doctor. Let me fix oh, wait a minute. Huh. Hey Phil. Yeah, I'm getting away. See you Oops. later. Yeah. Sorry, I shouldn't know your name. Well, but the, just the tension between the two is great, and the fact that Phil just lied straight to his face. Oh yeah, yeah, she's not here. Yeah, no, no, she's not anywhere in the building. No, but you know, do you know who else wasn't there? Right. Her dead mom. Oh, oh, who was revealed at the end? We're not going to say who it was, but it was great to see who Sky's mom really is. Yep. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Time to talk about the Flash. Make it quick. Oh, I just did, didn't I? Yeah. The Flash. It was called The Flash is Born. Uh, we are introduced to The Flash versus Colossus. Yeah. Um, no. Wait a minute. Isn't that Marvel? Not yeah. DC? Yeah. Why was Colossus there? Yeah, I'm sorry. His name's Girder. Never heard of him. He's this <laughs> guy who's made out of metal and he can get rusty and he has dreadlocks in the comics. This one did not have dreadlocks. No. No, but they did shoehorn him in as uh, Barry's high school bully for dramatic tension, which that's all fine and good. This episode, for the most part, while light and airy and fun, and you get to find out more about Barry's powers, yeah. mostly a throwaway except for uh, what happened with, uh, with, with, with Dr. Wells. Yeah, Dr. Wells and uh, Detective West, their tension back and forth was fantastic. You got to see the return of the yellow blur. Yeah. We'll call it. Sure. It's Yellow Street. Professor Zoom. Because we're not whatever. sure if it's Professor Zoom or right. it's Reverse Flash or what it is. Yeah. But that was very cool to see. Um, the Flash got to show his sonic boom punch that can annihilate people. It's which Guile is pretty from cool. Street Fighter. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> sonic boom. It's sonic right. boom. Yeah. And he, after he lands the hit, you know, irritating Iris just comes out of left field and finished with the finisher punch. And I'm like, wait a minute, he had to run from miles away to make this punch because work. Because the dude was made out of Colossus's <laughs> organic steel. You mean Garter steel? Same difference. <laughs> anyway, yeah. And then Iris lays him out while he's regular. I'm not. She's had the gloves on since she was six. I, I am being irritated by Iris right now, and I hope that changes. She still looks. Good, I hope though. it changes. Yeah. Uh, we got a new episode of Flash next week, but next week is the two. The week after that's a two-parter. Yep. Which leads For into. Arrow, which had a 
amazing things going on, start to finish. Great, great episode. First of all, Ray Palmer. Ray Palmer. Yeah. We'll, we'll get to Ray Palmer. Okay. Right. But Cupid, she had a fun little origin. Takes us back to the ending of season two. God, do they have enough archers on this show? <laughs> I mean, I get but it, at but least I don't they, get At least they didn't link it to the death of Sarah. True. You know, like they just kind of glazed over right. it and it was more about her. Dude, she took out Roy. Come Roy, on, Roy. Roy. Roy Roy's obviously so conflicted. Oh, I'm sorry. He can't remember how to fight. His name is Arsenal now. And he got his Arsenal kicked <laughs> by a girl. <laughs> Keep it was a throwaway, but I mean, it, there was other so many good things going on in this episode, I don't care. Ollie needed a love interest because his is getting stolen. Yeah. Just macked up by yeah. Ray Palmer. We'll, we'll get to that. Okay, sorry. <laughs> the flashback with Ali and Katana going off on the team. Oh, no, that was Trying awesome. to save her husband. Right. It was great because yeah. you got to see Katana. Yeah. Use her katanas. It was ridiculous. Uh, it really was. Yeah, she, really you know, was. she's known from Wolverine, you know, uh, The Wolverine. You know, she was actually in that also. I don't oh, know yeah, 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 yeah. That so, was right. So she's jumping to D.C., making an awesome, you know, appearance on this show. I just can't wait until they put her in the full outfit, and I want to know if it'll be the new one from the cartoon or if it'll be the old uh, red and, and, and gold. Yeah. You know, that'll be cool. So I can't wait to see that. Hopefully they'll take a good take on that. We're going to have a moment of Thea for a second, only because a DJ Mac and Spice came out of nowhere and was like, hey, I'm so awesome, I get half the door. And, yeah, because it takes, a, you know, a lot to get people dancing in a club. No, 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 hold on. This is the funniest part. <laughs> Here, keep your money. Yeah, keep your money. Then he, he lays the Mac down, kisses her, because she's an effing whore. Do you know That's why? Because Roy sucks and he can't do anything. No, what's he going to do? He got his ass taken out by a girl. And a DJ. Yeah. Yeah. Roy sucks. I DJ, mean, Arsenal. I mean, Arsenal. D DJ kick ass Arsenal yeah, somewhere. Yeah. Or other. I mean, <laughs> now we're going to be talking about the magic. What, Malcolm Merlin? No. The magician? No, he wasn't in this episode. Oh, thank God for that. Ray Palmer and Felicity. Yes! Ray Palmer <laughs> and Felicity. It was so magical. It was like it was like Disney on film in The Flash. It's sick. It's she has she has drank the Kool Aid. She is all about Ray now. Yeah, but she Ray likes Palmer. the new logo. Yeah, she she Palmer loves his Industries. vision for the future. Yeah, and we find out why Ray is buying this mind. Yes, the, the spoiler hat on. We got the reveal. Yeah, the Adam suit just appeared right in front of me. Yeah, it was beautiful. And Ray's like, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm he, Ray Palmer. Yeah, he's Ray Palmer, soon to be. Adam. Now you know, and I know, that you now love, you know, Brandon Routh. Oh, yes. So much. Well, <laughs> here. I, I, I don't want to say love Brandon Routh, because it's not like that. But um, his performance as Ray Palmer has actually made me appreciate his performance more as Superman, because initially I didn't like it. But seeing him in a light and airy kind of go-for-broke, all-free-for-all series thing that he's doing on Arrow makes me appreciate the nuances of his Superman performance. So... I actually like him more as an actor now, which helps me appreciate all his other work more. Even that crap in Scott Pilgrim. Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, with all the happiness going on in this episode, of course, Ollie can't be happy, and he's having his sad, you know, incredible Hawk theme music playing behind him pretty much as he walks through his life now. Yeah, poor, poor Ollie. Yeah, then he, then he decides to pick up crappy Roy and say, hey, Roy, let's go do something. I thought they were going to have ice cream or maybe get, you know, take a I couple shots gonna, at the bar. No, I thought they were going to go take shots, skip down the street, you know, stop get, and have a hot dog or yeah, something. Yeah, get a little yeah. paddle boat action yeah. toward the, you know. Yeah, and a swan <laughs> paddle boat. Yeah, that would be great. But no, all they yeah. did was go to Diggle's house for like a family dinner and family time, which I guess is good for everybody. It's good because, for everybody. Because, you know, Ollie's family consists now of... Uh, Basically, that poor Thea and uh, and his team and Roy. Roy's family consists of uh, basically anybody who won't diss him after he gets his ass kicked by a girl. Jesus, Roy, get your shit together. Don't worry, I think they have big plans for him. Doesn't he still have to lose an arm? It's all yeah, good. that's good. Let's yeah. wait until that happens. So well, phenomenal. What's happening is Arrow is taking a week off, and it's leading into the big Flash Arrow two-parter, and we got a little tease of how they're piecing that together with Captain Boomerang. At the end of the episode! Yeah, Captain Boomerang, everybody. Check that out. The Rogues Gallery is slowly but surely filling Yet itself out. Yet another alumni from Spartacus. This now is a tally of three. So, comments on TV. If you liked us this week, or if you didn't like what we were doing this week, please comment at the bottom. Like us on Facebook. 
Oh, find us on Twitter at The Real Comic Wow. Uh, you can watch us on Vimeo. And you can also subscribe to our YouTube channel. Please subscribe. That way you can get these awesome videos every time we put one out. And uh, you'll get to see everything we do. So subscribe. It's good for you. See you on ComicWild.com. See ya.